Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do a February grocery haul. And this month I actually came in under budget. I came in at $300 for the whole month of February. And if you hear the dog whining, it's because she's in the cage until I get everything put away because she will try to get into it if I don't. Some tomatoes, um, just eight of them, I think it's like $5. I got two packages of this hash brown frozen hash brown mix because it's really good to like put in breakfast burritos or as a side. I got two packages of tortillas. I only got one package of guacamole this time. I usually get two, but I'm actually going to try and make it myself, see if I can do that. I got these new Pop-Tart bites and they actually come with more pouches in them than the regular Pop-Tarts and our kids don't eat them as um, morning they actually eat them as snacks so afternoon snacks so I figured this would last a lot longer than giving them each a pack of pop-tarts I got go-gurts which Jensen will be super excited that they're Ninja Turtle this time last time they were Elsa I got some um, sour cream which got potato stuff all over the top of it eight boxes of shells and cheese the great value brand two things of biscuits for biscuits and gravy I got egg noodles for stroganoff I got two drink mixes this time, the Repel one, which is really great, I love that one, and then we're gonna, I'm going to try these energy ones to see if it will take away the caffeine headache since we stopped drinking pop and tea and anything like that. I got Lao Mein noodles, which is also new. Uh, we love Chinese food, and I usually make Chinese once a month, but everybody goes crazy for the noodles and not so much the vegetables, so I'm going to see if I can make more noodles this time and not so many vegetables in it. Lasagna for lasagna, obviously, a thing of onions. I also got these packs of oatmeal, two packs, different kinds of packs, a variety pack for breakfast. I want to see, it was cheaper to get the big box, but I wanted the variety box because I wanted everybody to try and see which one was their favorite and then I'll buy the big box of those next time. Pepperonis for after school snack ideas. I ran out of peppers, so I had to get pepper. Refried beans for after school snack ideas. String cheese for the children teriyaki sauce for those Chinese noodles, olive oil because we were out, vegetable oil, sugar, a big thing of ranch, and syrup. And the ranch and syrup is because we opened our one that we had in the pantry, and as soon as we opened something in the pantry, I like to get something right away to replace it. Three cucumbers to snack on, some bell peppers to snack on, two bundles of bananas, a package of cuties from Sam's, a block of cheese for either cheese dip or mac and cheese. A huge thing of rice to make some rice for me and Mike. Pizza sauce for after school snacks. I got eight ravioli cans. Um, the kids each get half of a can each for lunch if that's what they went for lunch. Two cantaloupes because they were actually under a dollar at Sam's Club. Over here we have our meats. I got two packages of chicken which each package will make four meals. Um, but what I'll do with one package is I will grill the whole thing up. So I slice them in half and then grill the whole thing up and freeze it. And then the other one I just slice in half and freeze it raw. Some chicken legs this time. I got legs instead of thighs because there just seem to be a lot more. And I usually just roast them anyways. A huge thing of beef. And it says 10 pounds, but I actually divide it into almost 12 or 13 things. I know it's like less than a pound each. But we don't do like hamburgers and stuff. This is something that we put into the spaghetti or taco meat. So we don't need a lot. A whole pound at once. Two boxes of four packs of um, pepperoni pizza. We have pizza every Friday. So two pizzas per Friday. This is a whole month worst. A huge thing of frozen broccoli. Um, there's actually four individual steamable microwavable bags in there. So... I like that it's already individually wrapped. That's really nice. Granola bars for snacks during the day. Dentine more for Mike Shepard's pie. And I ran out of elbow noodles, so I got the big pack of six pounds of them and tortilla chips. So there you have it. That's what we have for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snack for the month of February. I will add that there is a whole huge like 10 pound bag of potatoes already put away in the pantry and a case of water. And I still have to go to the store and get some stuff that they're out of. It is Super Bowl Sunday right now, so the stores were crazy packed. And um, they were out of a lot of stuff, so I have to get tomato juice for juice spaghetti. I have to get two cases of flavored water that they were completely out of at Sam's and a case of 
regular water because they were like limited one right now because they're so low because of Super Bowl Sunday. And I had to find Tostitos somewhere because my Walmart and my Sam's Club does not sell, or Tostada, sorry, does not sell Tostada. So I have to figure out where I'm going to find those for a little snack idea I have for the kids. But um, I added those prices into my budget and I still came under budget at $306 this month. So there is our monthly food budget if I can do it you can do it there's five of us in our house and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more like this hit that subscribe button and I hope to see you next time bye that we also do have to get eggs and milk but that is also already configured into the budget um, we'll get four gallons of milk and 60 eggs